So in the Bible, we find God meeting our needs in a, in a variety of very interesting ways. Let me give you just three examples. God as our Father meets our needs, first of all, by giving us instruction. Proverbs 4 verse 3 says, When I was a boy in my father's house, still tender, he taught me. He said, Lay hold of my words with all your heart. Keep my commands and you will live. I think one of the greatest privileges of being a dad is to teach your children, to show them things. Now, no, no parent is perfect. My, my, my father, though, uh, you know, was not a perfect man, but I think of all the things he taught me growing up. He taught me, he, didn't, he, didn't, he wasn't good with home maintenance, so if a hole got punched in the wall, you know what he did? Move furniture in front of the hole. I didn't, learn, I didn't learn that from dad, but you know what I learned? I learned how to change oil. I learned how to change a tire and fill my car up with gas. He taught me how to balance a checkbook. He taught me all about physical fitness and, and sports and taught me the game of racquetball, which I love to this day. That's one of the greatest privileges of being a dad is to teach your kids. But you know today, the millennials, they've done all kinds of studies. They don't know how to change tires on their car. I saw a 25-year-old a, a girl at a gas station who asked me to help pump her gas. Uh, no lie, a month or so ago. She pulled up. It was the first time she'd ever been there in her 20s. And my heart just broke. What kind of play home did she grow up in that she doesn't know how to fill her car up with gas? A loving father provides instruction. My friends, when you come to God's house, you are in your father's house. Yes? So what are you supposed to get in this place? Your father is going to what with you? He's going to teach you. One of the reasons you come here is, that your, is so that your heavenly father will teach you. Come, God says, and I'll teach you how to manage money my way. Come to my house and I'll teach you how to, how to be in a loving relationship. I'll, I'll teach you... A, a, a man how to love a woman and a woman how to love a man. I'll show you those things. I'll show you how to have peace in your heart and keep your body clean and pure. And here's how a son or daughter of mine works hard and lives with responsibility. You learn this from your heavenly father. And, and, and yet if you, if you don't go to church and you don't read your Bible and you don't have a heart that obeys God, you're not going to get that teaching. And how do you think your life's going to end up? You're going to be like that girl at the gas station. Jesus said, he who hears these words of mine and does not put them into practice is like a person who builds his house on sand. Is that you? Or will you listen to your heavenly father as he tries to teach you?